age and how many children you have. Okay, my name is Lena Flowers. I am 49 years old. I have 11 children. I have 10 boys, one girl. And they are going to, um, two is going to Crenshaw. Uh, two is going to um, First Start Cater uh, School, Carter School. And I have two going to Alvarez. My son was sick and he wanted to go to school. So I told him that, you know, he don't have to go to school today because he was sick. He said, no, mommy, I would like to go to school, which was between 8 and 30. So I said, okay, I wrote him a note and he walked out the door and he forgot to take the note because he left it on the counter. So when he was walking on his way to school, almost like 10 minutes before on the school grounds, the police officers, they pull over, they stop him, they question him, they run him down like he was, he was a gang member and they handcuffed him and took him into the school, to the office. They told, that, they told his, the supervisor that he was just wandering out there on the school grounds, you know, not coming into school, like he was banging, mm -hmm. okay? So what they did was they wrote him a ticket. After they wrote him a ticket, you know, they didn't have the decency to say, really call me and say, to verify, well, why was my son was late? You know, so it was like when I got the ticket, I had to take my son to the court to um, to pay that ticket, which was two hundred and fifty something dollars, which I don't have. So on that day, I took my son, which he missed in the school school day, mm -hmm. just to present himself in court about this two inch ticket that he got. Now I really can't afford this ticket, so I decided I'm going to fight this ticket. So I went to the court and I said, and I, when we was at the courtroom, the judge looked at me and said, well, um, hi, Timothy, um, you got a ticket, which is $250. So then I asked the judge, well, can I speak with you to then explain my situation? I don't want to hear your explanation. I want to talk with Timothy. So Timothy got up, explained to the teacher the situation that he was sick. He was walking to school. The police officer pulled him over, harassed him, took him to the office, and gave him a ticket. And here we are, trying to contest this ticket. And my mommy can't pay this ticket. So I went there and told the judge that I don't have the money for this ticket. She said, it's not my problem. But he, you know, he had to pay his tickets. I said, well, I'm gonna contest this ticket. And I took it to trial. And when I went to trial, I explained the same thing to the other judge. And the judge looked at Timothy. He heard of the situation. I said, well, Timothy, you don't have to pay this ticket, but I wanna make sure that you get up on time and go to school and don't be late. And Ma, when you, when your, your son or daughter is sick, just send a note with him. And I said, okay, judge, thank you and we didn't have to pay that ticket. But the simple fact that I had to get up and fight against this cause because I do not have the funds to pay for this ticket and I just want to explain myself about my situation. And I did just that.